Hey YouTube, I'm back from my holiday, so I'm just going to do a quick update on my on the Back to Eden garden. I didn't end up filming anything in the Okanagan, but that's okay. Um, I had someone kind of coming and just harvesting things while it's gone so that it wouldn't get um, wasted. And then also the day we got back, I've, I've done some work. The lettuce was done, the spinach was done, the, the kale was done. Um, peas are pretty much done too. That's about it. So I'll just kind of show you. I don't think I've ever had... Uh, zucchini that was that big. I guess some of the peas are still uh, got kick left in them. Uh, still a few peas, but they're getting kind of dry, and I hate this time of year because I hate it when it's done. Um, this zucchini plant here, I picked off four zucchini that had some blossom end rot. I mustn't have um, taken good care of that. Um, I got some ripe tomatoes. I've eaten my family picked quite a bit while I was gone and they ate and sent me lots of pictures of them enjoying it and I had eaten two or three and I have three on the counter now. Um, the beans are still doing pretty good. I picked a bunch today. I got back. My mo mother-in-law blanched a bunch from my freezer for me. Um, see if you can see how tall this is. It's like, I'm 5'4", and it comes up like more than half my half of me, so that's crazy. Um, lots of good zucchini from that. Here's my spaghetti squash. I can't believe what it's done. Um, I just want to eat it, but I know it's not quite ready yet. I don't actually know when to pick it. It's yellow, but not always through yet. So I don't know if you can see, every so often there's a spaghetti squash. And check, check this out, how crazy this is. I'm going to have to move my garden. Next year I'm going to uh, put my spaghetti squash out at my in-laws, make myself a little bit of an acreage, make a little plot of back to Eden there and, and put my spaghetti squash there because it just takes up like far too much space and like overtook everything. My Beets are getting squashed and like, like, it's huge. I've never seen anything like this before. So this is the second spinach I'd planted. A lot of it didn't quite make it. The carrots tops have overtaken quite a bit. Um, so I pulled the old spinach. I pulled the, most of the lettuce was like gross, seeding, tall, woody. Um, so let's see, you can see my down there. Pretty excited. I accidentally pulled a few small ones. Oh, I just noticed another one, which I ate. They were lovely. Uh, yes, this one I just noticed was out. It is quite sad. So I'll take those. I chop up. I'm gonna chop the leaves and freeze them for zomaborscht. In this Mennonite family we live in. Um, I think that's about it. Uh, oh, cucumbers! I actually have picked five. I didn't realize, apparently I have two varieties, so here I've got some more growing along English, which let me tell you, is so good. Um, and then this other plant I think is, I don't know, like a field cucumber? It was a completely, completely different cucumber I picked up that plant. Um, good, good lighting here. Anyway, that's about it for the update. Um, it's getting to that time of year where we start to be pulling some of the things that aren't ready, things are kind of here anyway winding down as far as non squash <laughs> um, and the carrots I wish I, I could show you some are huge like I looked I looked at my mother-in-law's carrots the other day when I was out there and they were still like threads and I picked like some of mine already now she did plant hers a little later that like it's huge Hers aren't even this big yet, like hers aren't, like, you can't even see hers, they just look like little tiny roots. So anyway, I think that's just amazing for the time of year and uh, I will always do a Back to Eden Garden from now on. And um, anyway, that's it. Like a lot to me has changed in the two weeks I've been gone. Um, everything's big and producing lots and, and big fruit and vegetables. Um, and I'm so excited. Uh, so anyway, I'll show you maybe some more harvesting later, maybe when my spaghetti squash is ready.
but um, thanks for watching. Bye.